Hey, Isaac. Hey, what's going on, Abel? Yo, you want to come over and play Karate Champ? Karate Champ? Yeah, remember Karate Champ? On the NES? Yeah. Fuck that game, dude. I already wasted a month of my life playing that game with you. Dude, you got to... What? So you don't want to come play? Uh, Hello? Think about it. Think about it? So you want to come over right now? You fucker. Hello? Hey David, you want to come over and play Karate Champ? Hey, Dad. Hey, Peter. Hey, uh, nothing. You want to come over and play Nintendo? Nintendo, you got Top Gun? Top Gun? No. I have Karate Champ. I have Top Gun. You don't want to come over? Oh, my God. Yeah. Yo, what's up? What's up? Uh, you want to come over and play some Karate Champ? Really? Hey, hey, what's up? Hey, Rob, you want to come over and play Karate Champ? <laughs> no, man. I got better shit to do right now. What do you got better to do than Karate Champ? <laughs> you gonna narf the guard there? Oh. Wait. Oh. Hello? Hey, Grandma. Hi, Sadie. Oh, what are you doing? Nothing. Watching TV. Oh. Hey, you want to come over and play Karate Champ? What's that? Uh, you remember uh, Bloodsport? That's the that's the video game that Frank Dukes and Ray Jackson play when they first meet. You're full of shit. Full of shit. Everybody was kung fu. used to play this game, we used to call it mash button so we'd fall over. And literally, it took us like a month to just learn the controls. Oh shit, we've been playing Cry Champ for like a whole month? As you just saw right there, boom, one month in our previous Django training video. But anyways, we hated this game a lot, but it was only one of the few versus two-player games I had on Nintendo. So let's go give this shit a go. Skill you on this. I think I know the jump kick. Yeah, there it is. Alright, switch the music on. Oh, fuck! Okay. It's like Double Dragon 2 controls. You know, you push B and it hits wherever's behind you, and I know there's a. Ah, oh, fucking A, man! Okay, I know there's a move that turns you around. I don't know how to do it, but I know there's one. Right there, I'm like fucking nuts. Oh, see, so you made him cry. What's up with that, man? That's karate. It's what you're supposed to do. Anyways, the top left is the... God damn it. The top left is the point... Yeah, right in the air, dude. Is the point system. Some hits give you one full point. Others give you half a point. I don't even know exactly which does... Or which attacks give you which. But sometimes... Let's see with this. See, sometimes that gives me one full point. Other times it gives me just like a half. So I don't know if it's... If it's just a... Oh, man. 
<laughs> Remember this game being hard. Yeah. Oh, look, that's that move. Yeah, that, that turnaround move that I just did. That I hope I don't do again, because that almost cost me the match. Yeah. But any ah, fucking A. Okay. Anyways, I think it's a counter thing, where if I hit him while he's trying to do something, I get a full point. I'm not sure. God damn it. That's not good. Yeah. And then, um... I remember after you get... It's best two out of three rounds. <sighs> God damn it, now they're tied. Okay, best two out of three, and after each round, you get a little bonus minigame thing where... Somebody's just throwing like flower pots at you. Like our little vases full of flowers. And oh, come on. Let's do it. There you go. And you hit them and rack up points until it hits you and you fall on your face and die. Whatever. Like that guy. Look at that. Boom. Clean sweeps. Third round. Yeah. Now you're doing like a little Ch uh, Chun Li cheer motion thing. I don't know what's up with that. Yeah, well Chun Li copied that from me. Oh shit, they're coming from behind. Oop. Oh no, fuck! I guess you can't take that one to the can you? No. I tried to do a back sweep and some, for some reason he did a high kick. And boom, Boy. in the face. And sometimes, well not sometimes, after every round the scenery in the back changes. And I know there's a... There's an alley stage where it's like you're just behind a building at, at night fighting. And then there's like a sunset stage where the referee guy is on a tree, you know, just watching you guys fight. And I, I don't know if I'm remembering, god damn it, if I'm remembering this, but maybe there's a beach stage? The stages really don't matter though, god I'm losing this round. And all in on rare, god damn. Okay, only on rare occasions have I got past the second part. You know, um, while well, playing one player, because when you play two players, you just keep going until whenever. Right. So. Honestly, well, I'm noticing the judge waving his hands for the point. It looks like, honestly, he's flipping you off. Well, on this stage, it looks like he has no hands at all. Because it blends in the background. Yeah. But. You know what? It does not look like he's flipping him off. He looks more like he's doing the Hitler salute more than anything. Mm -hmm. Or a thumbs up like, yeah, you did it! Yeah, okay, here it is. Tiebreaker. Oh my god! Okay, and there's no continue points either. So, as soon as you lose two rounds in one game, you go back to the main menu. See? Game over. It's kind of ridiculous. So this is one of those games, no stories, it's just no story, no ending, no whatever. It's just a karate tournament, I guess. See how far you can go, and then everything just loops. So let's... Alright, I'm gonna stop fucking around now. Oh, god damn it. Okay, now I'm gonna stop fucking around. You see, when he kicks you down there, and it's like you're lying down, it looks like he just buried you, not only with the kick. Well, I would say more like a side view of somebody getting buried. Like, you know, you play Twisted Metal on the PlayStation 3? Yeah. Okay, you know, Sweet Tooth Sanding, how he's like buried, how it shows it kind of from just from the side angle? Yeah. Like that. Kind of like a museum piece. And this is where I kicked him in the face and he went to. Well, do museums show side views of dead bodies in the ground? Like still in the ground? Well, no, I mean, they just show, like, you know, a side view of a pyramid. Oh, here's with a sarcophagus should be that kind of stuff. But, I it, but is it the real pyramid? No, not exactly. Okay. I don't think they can actually get the giant pyramid from Egypt in a tiny little case, probably like 10 feet by 10 feet. Well, Gru can do it. Despicable me. Yes, but there's no such thing as a shrink ray. You don't know that. And I really... Oh, my God. I really need to be focusing. I'm getting my ass kicked in the first round. First stage, boom, boom kick. Nice. I do notice though, you just miss a lot. It's like you try to go for the same move and you just. Well, the hit detection sucks. You see how I was clearly kicking that guy in the face, and then he tags me, and that's it. And already I'm sick of this game. Yeah, I can imagine. So, I'm gonna quit now. Uh, you wanna play a really hard game that's hard to control and will piss you off with hit detection go for it but I really wouldn't recommend it it's boring